Okay, still here at Kempton for the Christmas hurdle, which is a G1. I'm wait for the runners to come up. So we've got some new cameramen this week. So the two mile Christmas hurdle, grade one. Number one is Bold Ruler for Thunderspark. Two is Hit to Be Square for Joshua Southern. The favourite three, Hurricane Fly for Ghost Sapper. Four, Japanese Jim for Doug Warren. Five, Radio Missile Alex Cherry. Six, Rod Laverpool Road. Seven, Cumber Villara for D Thompson. Set eight, eight, Elizabeth Van for D Hinton. And nine is Orange Eyes for Molly at Surfer. So nine of them under the starters' orders here. Over this two miles. And they're off. And they're straight into the first hurdle, which they all negotiate very well. And we're going to see who's going to take them along. And it's Elizabeth Van for Del Hinton. That sprints off to the front, takes the second. And he's uh, got himself a four length advantage as they go past the grandstand here with a circuit to go. Here at Kempton, we've got, obviously tomorrow we've got the King George of Six Chase. It's the big race here tomorrow. Good luck in that, everyone. But it's Elizabeth Van here that leads us over this two miles by about five lengths to Bold Ruler in second. And we've got Hurricane Fly, Japanese Gin and Rod Laver between those two. And a couple of lengths back to Orange Eyes. And Cumber Valara, Hip to be Square and Radio Missile. So up front is still Elizabeth Van. Leads by about four now. Lost radio missile out of the picture, and I think he's still there as they take the third, and everybody's over that. So it's to Elizabeth Fan, stealing a bit of a march here. It's only two miles. The rest of the jockeys all want to uh, shorten this gap. Although Elizabeth Fan steadied himself going into the fourth, but still has a four length advantage over Boulderer in second, Rod Laver in third, and then the remainder, which is Hurricane Fly, Orange Eyes, Japanese Gin, Cumber Vlar, and Hip to be square. A couple of lengths behind those, and I can't see radio missile at the moment. But it's Elizabeth Van that still leads them. We've got over a mile left to travel. There's only four flights to take, but it's Elizabeth Van by four lengths to Rod Laver now in second on his own. The rest of the pack are starting to bunch up behind, and Elizabeth Van's advantage is starting to be shortened. So it's Elizabeth Van by three to Rod Laver in second. Takes the fifth. Oh, and one that went through the top of the fifth there was Bold Ruler. He's demoted himself into second to last because I can't see Radio Missile. But up front is still Elizabeth Van. Here comes Hurricane Fly to challenge. Rod Laver against the fence. Couple out wide orange eyes and Japanese gin. Then we've got Hip to be square on the inside of that with Cumber Villara and Bold Ruler. They take the six. They've only got two flights to take and it's still Elizabeth Van. Been there since the beginning but only leads by a couple now from Hurricane Fly. But they've got about three lengths on the rest. Japanese gin leading that pack and coming out of the... Is also Bold Ruler. But it's still Elizabeth Van by just two lengths now with five furlongs left to travel. So approach the bend. The final home turn. It's Elizabeth Van that leads from Hurricane Fly in second. They lead by about four lengths to Bold Ruler. Japanese Gin out wide. The two in between are Rod Laver and Cumber Valara. Moving well on really on the outside now is Orange Eyes. The one that's getting caught for toe now is Hip to be Square. But it's Elizabeth Van still up front and starting to pull away again from Hurricane Fly in second. On the outside here comes Orange Eyes. Japanese Gin having a really good run against the fence is Bold Ruler. My own has got nowhere to go, Bold Ruler. But it's still Elizabeth Van. But here comes Orange Eyes to challenge inside two and a half furlongs. Elizabeth Fan, Orange Eyes, these two neck and neck, and it's going to be Orange Eyes that's going to lead them into the seventh, gets over it well, but here on the outside comes Cumber Villara, so it's Orange Eyes, Cumber Villara, Bold Ruler, further wider is Hurricane Fly, making up some good ground now, is hit to be square, with a fern on left to go, they get over the final flight, and it's Orange Eyes that leads, but here comes Bold Ruler to challenge with Cumber Villara, Orange Eyes leading for Molly at Surfer, inside the last hundred yards, it looks like Orange Eyes is going to take the Christmas hurdle, wins it from Bold Ruler in second, Cumber Villara are in third. I think Hip to be square might have uh, got himself up there, but it's not. It's Orange Eyes for Molly at Surfer. Well done. Second is Bold Ruler for Thunderspark. Third is Cumber Valara for Darren Thompson. Fourth was Rod Laver for Paul Rhodes. And fifth was Hurricane Fly for Ghost Sapper Stables. Well, that's it for the week, guys. We're over for the day. We'll see you tomorrow.